Hello everybody. This is going to be about the joke ones. Now, <clears throat> if we go back to the first time we meet the most famous, the most loved, and crazy, out of his mind, deadly clown, the joke one doesn't really have an origin story. And by really, I mean we know nothing but he is a clown, he is a killer, he was going to be a one-off villain. Batman killed him off by stabbing him in the heart. And was supposed to die. Yeah. So, the point I'm getting at here is no origin. That's why every form of entertainment can have their own origin for this clown. I like all of them for the exception of one. The ape from the animated series The Batman. Jared, uh, Jared Leto's Joker isn't really bad, it's just different. It's different from um, Jack Nicholson's, uh, Heath Ledger's. It's different, it's not bad. All jokers are different. If we had the exact same type of joker, it, it would probably get a little bit boring. So I'm happy with Jared Leto's version of the joker. We got the uh, 60's version. I can't think of the guy's name off the top of my head, I'm sorry. But from the 60's, he was just in it for the money in um, the 1989 Batman movie, we got Jack, and he was all about just being crazy, killing people, and being being in love or something. Heath Ledger, it's Joker. Heath Ledger just wanted to burn everything down. He was like a war soldier or something. That uh, had mental problems and stuff. Uh, Jared Leto's is a gangster type of joke, so it's fine. It's not bad. And now, if you have your own opinion of him, that's fine. This is about my opinion. I liked it, and I hope I see it again. <clears throat> And that's really all I have to say for this video. Um, the picture that I'm using here is from DeviantArt called Joker's Art done by Brian Zapp. You can look that up on DeviantArt, obviously. Just to note one more little detail here. Whose idea was to make Joker an ape? I mean, really. Come on. 